Hi, babies. How y'all doing? What's coming on? Not much of shit. You already know, if you don't know, what this is going to be. Alright, next. Um, I was in, what the hell was the store? I was in Walgreens. It was either Walgreens or Rite Aid or whatever the fucking store was. And you know how you walk down the aisles, the cosmetic aisles, where they sell, like, the baths, goodies, and whatever. And you see these little pack packets of, like, on-the-go facial, like, you on-the-go mask or whatever. Now, I, for some reason, and am I the only person I can't seem to find in the stores, a facial mask. And I'm big on my face. I have to do my face. But I can't seem to find a, a, a nice, like, I used to be able to find them all the time, a good clay mask. And I'm like, what's really popping? I'm not excited about this at all. We're about to fight. But I happen to see them like loads of go, little, you know, like loads of go packets. So I found one, right? And there's this one. Now, if you can see the picture, if, <laughs> if you can see the picture on this shit, I don't know if I can make it any clearer to you. But the picture alone makes me scared to use the shit. The bitch got shit on her eyes. Check the bug man. The shit is blue. Now, years ago when I was a wee little girl, wee little nappy head, I had a Barbie. Barbie was white. And I had this thing where I used to mix shit up and put it together and use it with Barbie. I mixed some talcum powder and some lotion and some other shit and... And put it on the plate, you know, my little Barbie play plate. She has dim, dim plates. That's dinner for Barbie. We've been cooking. Like, I was going to make the shit real. Fine. <laughs> well, my mother used to wear a mask all the time, so I decided I was going to make a mask for Barbie. And I put some shit in there. Whatever I put in there to make it a pretty color, the same color as my mother's mask. Barbie put I put on Barbie face. When I took it off Barbie face, Barbie was blue. And that's what this shit right here makes me think. It makes me think, am, am I going to be blue when I take this shit off my face? It is mask a la boue. Anti-stress. Dead sea. For normal oily T-zone to ultra deep cleanse the pores. Okay. Who knows? But that ain't, that ain't, this ain't the kicker. This shit right here is the kicker. Now, when I saw it, I've seen this a couple times. I know y'all seen these packets. I've seen this shit a couple times. And I was like, should I avoid this shit like the plague? Or what? <laughs> Something ain't right. This. Now, I don't know if y'all can see what I see here. But the bitch's face has a mask on it, right? And these graphics on the mask. So, I'm thinking... Why would you superimpose in editing, you know, to make the package? Why would you superimpose that shit onto the mask? Like, that doesn't make it any more appealing. Just like this bitch and her bug eyes is no more appealing. Why would you superimpose? Can y'all see that? This bitch got trees and shit on her face. Like, on the, on the mask. But the Photoshop is a motherfucker. So I'm thinking, you know, they done Photoshop some shit on the bitch face. And I'm looking at it. I'm like, why would any, why would you, like, why, who decided that that would be smart for marketing strategy? I guess whoever thought that the bug eyes were smart for marketing strategy on this. This shit freaks me out. And that's why the motherfuckers sell like they do. So I flip it over and I realize, no, no, these aren't graphics. That's really how this shit looks. <laughs> what? <laughs> I got to sip on that one. So, <clears throat> mother's going to put this on her face today. We're going to vlog with the shit on my face. We, we, why not put this shit on too? Now, this one, the crazy people, it is lemon and ginseng. I have an issue. So, there's a couple things I need y'all to watch and watch. I'm glad I'm vlogging about this because it's a concern of mine that something's going to happen. One of these concerns come because a lot of this uh, package, and when you see it in the stores, people 
You'll understand what I'm talking about. A lot of this package is not in English. Like, okay, it says the lemon and ginseng, and then to the side it says citron and ginseng, and then, you know, it says it in a couple different languages. But then, I don't know how to put the shit on. I will go over it as I'm putting it on my face. Should I try this one, two babies? Y'all want to see what happens when mama put this one on her face? Who knows? I, you know, when you had a couple glasses or one glass in just a very long day, that's what happens. Oh, let me show y'all pumpkins what I'm sipping on. I'm having some Volga Pinot Grigio. I know it's down here. I ain't drink all this shit by myself. I had friends. Um, it's a Volga. Isn't this sexy for wine? Just put this on your table like, bitch, right in barrel for your ass. I likes it. I think the bottle's sexy, which is definitely good for marketing. And it's really, it's actually really good. Uh, Pinot Grigio. I'm a white wine lover. I love the Pinot Grigio, the Sauvignon Blancs. Um, Rieslings, not everybody's. That Chateau Saint Michel is fucking garbage. Uh, but that's pretty good. Um, there's a couple of other ones that I'm just like, Woo, I drink you on a special day because I can't afford you. Boom. But today we're sipping on that and we're putting shit on the face. I need a fucking life. For real. I go to work, I drink wine, I put shit on my face, and I do video editing. Do you see this bitch? What the fuck? Okay. And then it says treatment. I've never seen it spelled like this. T R A I T E M E N T. What language is that? I'm not being funny. I'm serious. What language is that shit? Okay. Brooklyn! I might need backup. Brooklyn! What will happen? Our natural essences of lemon and ginseng will detox. We use natural oils. Some of you may experience tingling too. Coupled with the antioxidant effects of green tea and red grape juice. Red grape juice? Bye bye. Smell like a cocktail I've made. Oh, oh. Can you, yeah, I want y'all to be able to see what I'm doing here. It's just me, so it's not like I can have much assistance with this. Okay. This is a, okay. I see the trees and shit already. Okay, then what? Remove. So I gotta open this shit up. I'm opening it up. I'm opening it up. <laughs> opening it up. No more wine for me. No more wine. It's wet. It feels soapy. It feels like a wet ass dryer sheet. Okay, so I'm taking the nose piece off. If, oh, shit, I should have showed y'all. Black magic woman. Okay, I'm taking the nose piece off of it. It may tingle too. This shit better not. Where am I supposed to put this shit? Put this on my nose. Put this. This is the mouthpiece. Hmm. Put this on my nose. And yeah, fuck it. Okay, it's on my nose. And it's, ooh, it's firm. Like it just. And then I'm going to put the rest on my face. Can y'all see this like little prints of the shit on my nose? Jesus help me.
can you see the people the little uh trees and shit these little trees and shit all up in the yeah and the shit on the nose and it's a little awkward. okay it's been about 10 to 15 minutes since i had this shit on my face i'm supposed to take it off Gently massage in any excess liquid and splash my face with cold water. Nothing's burning, nothing's tingling. It's a little itchy right here and right here. But we'll find out. I don't feel detoxed. I don't feel refined. I don't feel like I'm gonna have to sue either. Rub it in. There's not much excess liquid. My face feels a little, a little tacky. So we'll see if any of that changes with the cold water. particularly rejuvenated in face and I also don't feel like I'm gonna break out which means this does not have to I feel tacky ah I can't do it I can't I can't do it baby I was like shit feels like I was like it does feel I would just say it does feel heavy but fuck this I feel like I got some shit oh, on my face. I had to whip out my facial cleanser, kids. Mama had to whip out a facial cleanser. I can't have some shit sitting on my face and I'm just like, what the hell? Why does it feel... Your face shouldn't feel tacky. Like, what the fuck is that? So we already know, okay, the crackhead mask is not the one for Mama. Try it. Let me know what you think about it. I got this one for like Walgreens or... CVS, a ride date, or whatever it was, they were like two for three dollars. So it's only gonna cost you maybe a dollar or some change. I want y'all to try to see what y'all think of it. If it's gonna break your shit out, then don't do it. But wait. I'm rinsing. On a plus side, I'm about to go blind trying to talk to y'all babies. Hold on. My face ain't even all the way rinsed off. On a plus side, this stuff is vegetarian standard and it is against animal testing. So I'm pretty sure it's pretty safe, but give it a go. Let me know if you guys have tried it or you've thought about trying it or whatever, because y'all know what my reaction is. 